Welcome back. Today we're going to do some speed hacking. We're going to start by putting one day in advance. You can see all of my VIP quests are done. Once you close out the game and we re-enter it, you have to put the speed hack in one more time. So we're going to put it in right here, one day ahead. And if it all loads properly, all of those VIP quests are going to come back. Unfortunately, there is no easier way I've found. It is a little bit time consuming, but you can make it to level 13 VIP pretty easily in a day if you just put a little effort into it. I know most of the hacks we do require no effort. This one requires a little bit of work. So if it loaded up right, should be able to log back into the quests and boom, all there, all back. You can go through, I got unlucky, it's not the good one. The Spec Ops one is better. You can fly through it very quickly and do all six. Um, the cool part about this is if you use one of your VIP tickets to make it active, it um, will stay active regardless of how far you go, um, how many days you go into the future. It won't matter. The VIP doesn't get changed. For some reason, you can hack speed hack the VIP quest, but it doesn't affect that, which is really cool. So now I'm just going to go and do four or five of the quests. I think this one called for level four rhinos with fusion. So we'll do that real quick. Probably got to do it twice. Done. And we'll get the first VIP. Done. Next one is probably fuse rhinos. Yeah. So now we got to go over and fuse rhinos. This is the easy part. You could, right after you finish this, speed hack again to the next day. Um, I decided to go and do drop the acid gas and blow up the barrels, get at least four of the quests, and then skip. Fly through this real quick. I wish I had a better hack, because back when the... Uh, Arctic base first came out you could hack all the way to VIP 17 in uh, one or two minutes and then you could hack the rest of the way five minutes later they patched that pretty quickly and you know it is what it is go through here skip some of the battles get that part out of the way blow up the barrels drop the acid gas finish off the battle rinse and repeat over and over until you get both of your VIPs so I got the four I needed. Now I'm going to go back in, check it, make sure they're all clear. Now this time, instead of going one day ahead, we're going to go two. And when you look on the speed hack part of Game Guardian, which will pop up here in just a sec, we're going to hit that, and you have to do, you have day, hour, minute, second. So two colon zero colon zero colon zero is two days going to close out once we restart it i'm immediately going to open game guardian and i'm going to make sure and load the speed hack one more time collected data speed hack is loaded now once again all of those quests will be available for you to knock them out if you're lucky and you're on the right rotation you'll be getting spec ops you can do all six super quick and it's somewhere around 1500 v vip for every time you do the speed hack so you're able to fly through levels pretty quick all right i'm gonna be out for a bit i'll be back after a few minutes a few moments later i'm back vip 20 platinum vip reached there's the vip special rewards you get I hope you enjoyed the video, 100% done through speed hacking. Like, subscribe. There's more content coming on its way. If you have any comments or games you'd like hacked, please leave a review. Thank you. As always, more to come.